Hi and welcome back. Now in this lab we are going to look at virtual machine storage. So here we are in the Azure portal. I have one virtual machine in place. Now if I go on to the disk, I can see the OS level disk which is of size 127 GB. On this the host caching is read write. Now if you want to add data disk, so it's very important let's say you're having an application on this particular server, you should host your data for that application on a data disk. So you can click on add data disk. Now we don't have an existing data disk so we need to create a new one. So you can give a name for the disk. You can use an existing resource group. I'm going to choose the account type as premium SSD. You can actually specify the source as a snapshot, a storage blob or just none. So I'm just going to leave it as an empty disk. I'm just going to create a small size for the disk and click on create. Once the disk is created, click on save. So now the save operation is updating the disk on the virtual machine. Now once the operation is complete, and if you go on to your Windows VM, if you go on to File and Storage Services, if you go on to Disk, you will now see one disk which is currently uh, online but it's an unknown partition. So now the disk has only been added to the server. You still have to create a volume out of this disk. But you can see that this 10 GB disk has automatically been added to your Windows Virtual Machine.